Well, you know, I had grown up with a fistful of dollars and the good, the good, and the bad, and the ugly, and you know, even in Rawhide, you know, I'd seen him a certain way, certain look, you know, and, and knew that you don't mess with him, and you know, and then here you had him, the first sequence, him leaving his family, having to get on that horse, and he can't get on the horse, you know, him get, getting a cold, and and it was the first time that I felt anxiety, to where due to the fact that the hero I was supposed to follow and make everything all right at the end of this movie came down with the flu, you know, and seemed to do nothing or be able to do anything about his circumstance. He almost felt like a victim. Um, and, and when he finally finds retribution and starts to drink again and then goes and attacks everybody. I didn't go, yay! I went, oh, how sad a s situation this is for a man who has so much going for his life, who's experienced so much tragedy, having to go back into tragedy to find redemption. And, and that, that theme really messed with me. But at the same time, it was such a beautiful statement, especially one for Clint Eastwood to, to make given his background in the westerns. I think it was really a movie that moved me.